Your CBS News Baltimore Evening. I'm sorry, three, two. This year's CBS News Baltimore Evening Update for Monday, May the 6th. I'm Vic Carter. Tonight, we're learning more about a deadly party bus crash that shut down I 95 north for several hours yesterday. It happened around 6 o'clock yesterday morning. Maryland State Police say the bus crashed into a guardrail in Bell Camp in Hartford County. 24 adults were on board. Police say one passenger died at the scene. Several others were taken to local hospitals, including UM Upper Chesapeake Health in Bel Air and Aberdeen. Chief Medical Officer at UM Upper Chesapeake says that all 11 patients treated at the Bel Air and Aberdeen campuses have been released. Police are investigating a crash that killed one person after a car hit a vacant home in Jessup. Police say an officer attempted to pull over a speeding car near Annapolis Road and Reese Road, but the driver kept going. The officer did not follow the car. Minutes later, a 911 caller reported the crash into a nearby home on Jessup Road. Police say one passenger died at shock trauma. The driver and other four passengers were seriously injured. No word yet on whether any charges will be filed. Slow down if you're driving through Baltimore City. Starting today, there are new speed cameras on North Monroe Street. They're all set up near Matthew A. Henson Elementary and Carver Votech High School. The cameras will operate weekdays from 6 a.m. to 8 p.m. If you're found going 12 miles per hour over the speed limit, you can expect to receive a $40 fine in the mail. That's your evening update for CBS News Baltimore. I'm Vic Carter.